Hello guys and welcome to Plod Along Pozolski episode 9 maybe? Uh, no, but we have entered Portugal as you can see there and uh, this is the first team we come up against. It is a uh, sort of League 1 team slash French slash whatever. But it was one all. Rolando scored for us and I think Menez scored for him. Oh, excuse me. Oh, I'll be honest, I can't remember. But we did then come against a silver Liga MX squad. Um, I just want to say, for Plod Along Podolski, I think the maximum amount of uh, episodes we will have before we move country will probably be three. Um, mostly, I'm guessing one or maybe two. But um, it'll be the odd occasion when three, because the next country I'm in, which you'll see probably at the end of this episode, um just I just couldn't win in it. It was really hard. But um at half time this guy's absolutely dicking on me, even though he has got a silver team. Um but in the forty eighth minute we go for a bit of um near postage um OP and it's one all. Um but str I don't know why I filmed that far. But uh, Raul Pereira finds Helder Postig, who finds Podolski, who's not going to miss from there. Absolutely buries it in the 54th minute to put us in the lead the first time in the game. Um, then Danny does find Helder Postiga, a bit of a screwball scrabble in the box, and Helder Postiga does pick it back up. And um, I'm going to tell you now, Helder, Helder Postiga is dog shit. Uh, never buy him. He's 500 coins. He's not worth 500 coins. Um... It's worth about six, but uh, I thought Danny does deserve a goal. He's been playing quite well, and what can I say? It's a really nice finish for him in, in the 67th minute-ish um, to take it to 4-1. And this guy with his extremely fast team, it was rapid, does actually go and get one consolation goal to take it to the score of Doom at 4-2. We all know it's going to be over at 4-2. Um, this guy was a really good opponent, actually. Um, I might have a look at his team later and possibly build it as a squad builder, but I'm not sure. But yeah, he did get a red card as well, which um may have hindered him for the rest of the game because I did get through his defence quite easily after that. Um, it was a stupid tackle, but he didn't give away a penalty or anything. He gave away a free kick. Um, but personally, I didn't think it was a red card anyway. It was probably a yellow. But Rui Patricio getting man of the match um, and 518 coins and we do go on into the next game now. Uh, we did come up against the Newcastle team and I don't know but his formations are all off, they're out of position but it this game kind of goes tits up. Yeah, <laughs> there's, there's not what I can say. What? Oh wow! I'm a bit of a cripple, and you'd th you'd think I'd learn from my mistake. I did go to kick it, but you forgot to. Um, but I don't learn from my mistake, and I pass it straight back to him. He's faster than all my defenders. I'm not gonna take anything away from that goal because that chip was absolutely perfect. I'm not gonna lie. I wish all of my chips are like that, but they're not. Uh, and from Goofran as well. Fucking Jesus. But pretty much from kickoff, um, Danny does go and find, <coughs> excuse me, Nanny, who chips it through to Podolski, who cuts back, cuts back inside again, and makes it 2 1, which is the final score. 2 1, another goal for Podolski. He needs, oh, let me think now. 3 9. Needs one more in the country. Oh, wow, I am so good at maths. <laughs> Uh, one more in the country to um, move move on. Why why am I being such a tard? To move on. Pepe with the man of the match with an 8.7 rating. And how many coins did we get? Tell me how many coins I got. Stop looking at Goofran. Goofran actually did have a really good game. Um, I don't think I've ever fully played with him. Um, but look at this team. This team scared the shit out of me. Um... 
Is what can I say? Look at it. Rooney, Van Persie, Aguero in Cam, Mike on company, Larice, and Larice is a bugger to lose. But ah, <coughs> uh, 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 um, let, let's just completely forget we've ever seen this. Uh, that was a seven-one defeat. I'm not gonna lie. In the next country, I've said that loads now. Um, but I'm not. Um, in the next country, you'll see more of them because they're bastards to play with. But um, we also then come up against another strong BPL side, and they do just cause you issues, like no matter what. And you're always gonna come up against them, and because they've all gone down, the good players are getting snatched for cheaper pl prices and you're coming up against them more and look at that for a finish that in the f 16th minute is proof why BPL teams are so good and that I can't explain just a cheeky little rebound in 19th minute isn't it really but um yeah this guy when it came to celebrating was a bit of a cock then Van Persie again scored took it in to 3-0 in the 34th minute and um, then David Silva crossed it. Then Matter scored. Took it to 4 0 in the 36th minute. And uh, that's how we went into half time. 4 0 down. I was pretty pleased with myself after that 7 1 defeat. I wasn't. <laughs> I wasn't too optimistic for the rest of the um, rest of the games. But Helda Postiga. Uh, Jao Martini is just like, no, you shit. Just get it to Podolski. Podolski gets it. Tenth goal in the country takes him on to the next one. Portugal, good Portugal, Portugal, good bye. Stop raping me, Helder Postiga, you shit. This guy's connection just went completely, and um, I don't know whether his internet crashed, EA was been a dick, or he just decided that and fuck this and fucked off. But I'm not sure. But it was four-one. Uh, no games were taken off us. We kept all our points. Um, I'm pretty happy with that. I'm not. I'm not. Um, I'm not going to say that. Um, but never mind. Um, yeah. So that's 50 goals for Podolski. Let's have a look. Um, yeah. I think that's going to wrap up the episode as well. Uh, we're just going to get rid of Helder Postiga because you bullshit, mate. You're absolutely dog shit. And yeah, it was 50 goals for Podolski. Uh, the next country we are going to be moving to, straight over the sea, over to Morocco, the worst team I've ever played with. But um, as I said before, that is going to wrap up the episode, so I'll see you next time of whatever I make, lads, in, well, and ladies, and in a bit, goodbye. <laughs>